just memed. <laughs> Tell us the path we've, we've got next. There's many questions, Will, that I would like to have answered. Uh, okay, we've got Golurk, Tokol, uh, Hililesk, um, Venusaur, Cinderace, and Charizard. Super hard Sun team. Um... I think we got Talent, Kingdra, Polytoad, and um, got Ashifu. There we go. Right. Let's see if we can. Um, I mean, that team kind of fits with their name. It's like the, you know, the toaster, the hot, the sun, the sun team. There we go. We've all got it going on. Mizzet, how you doing? I was wondering if someone could help me understand why I can't use my LOL and Sand Slash and rank doubles. So, the rank ladder doesn't update to Series 5 until Wednesday, the 1st of July. So, come the 1st of July, you will be able to use your... Alolan Sand Slash or any other Pokemon like that, but you have to wait for the rules to update, which is which is Wednesday, unfortunately. I hope that kind of helps shed a bit of light on the whole situation. Um, okay, let's go after the Venusaur with a Max Airstream and a U-turn from our Talon player. The only issue is, okay, well, Torkoal's coming in, so that's fine. Easy Cheesy, thank you so much for the follow. Okay, so Torkoal coming in. This is fine. I think. Yeah, this is fine. I mean, what's Acelerate going to do? Max Airstream as well? Kind of indicate to me that the Venusaur is not sashed it's switching out like that right well I had a shiny Kingdra in Auras named Colgate <laughs> you've got to trade that over dude you've got to trade that over Right, Aaron, Toby, are you guys ready for that for that match? We can do that after this if you want. Lou, how are you doing? Muffrey as well. Thanks so much for joining, guys. I hope you're all well, having a good evening. Had a good day. I'm looking forward to some some fun with rain tonight. A jump kick. Miss. Is it going to miss? Nah. Oosh. That is nasty damage. Okay. Um... Can we switch Politoed out, get Talonflame back onto the field, and chase down this. Bunny, try and get it. Lou, it is going really well, thanks. I hope you're doing well. Hope you've had a nice weekend. Heard your stream earlier went very well, so I'm sorry I couldn't uh, hop in and catch it. It's working, but um, yeah, sounded like a lot of fun. Dive Ball Shiny Kingdra. It is, indeed. It is. Had to be, it's the only ball. Um, although, I am try when I was trying for my Politoed, I didn't have it in a dive ball, and I never got it. I got two damp, shiny poly wags, so I was, I was super upset with that. At least one of them could have been Swift Swim, but nah. But I've, I've, I've managed to breed quite a few shinies coming into this series. So I've got Kingdra, I've got Politoed now because of Berum. Uh, I've got a, a Talonflame, which isn't this one because I just didn't have time to level it up before tonight. I've got a Magnazon, which is nice. Uh, Alakazam, which is also quite cool. Is this is Combi Slash. Booster. No. Okay, that's fine. And then, yeah, it was great. Nice. Nice to battle in Series 5, yeah. I thought you might enjoy it. I'd, have you tried Gigalith yet? We've got a cool Gigalith team if you want to you borrow that. I'm sure you would enjoy that. Hopefully so many streams going on these days. It's pretty cool, yeah. I was saying that to... Um, I was speaking to David from um, 
Victory Rod the other day and I was just like it like all the tournaments that have been going on um like recently it's just like it's so amazing like through all this like crazy time that we've had um the amount of tournaments that we've got going on it just makes it it just makes it super nice for the community and I feel like it's like the one good thing to come out of the um the whole pandemic that we've had going on to stream this Venus or Mike Max and Yil093, thank you so much for the follow and for joining us tonight. I hope you've had a good day. I hope you enjoy the stream of this. Um, well, I like in Let's Go when you... What? What, 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 what? I need to see this. It's, it's disappeared too quickly. Uh, when you beat like a picnicker and it says you got two great balls. <laughs> okay, it wasn't really worth going scrolling back up to read that, but I do appreciate it, Will. Oh, Johnny, I saw your scrap. I saw it. I was, um, it was like the same time I got my second damp polywag. Brutal. Brutal. And legit send through Giggles team. I will do. Definitely. You'll like it as well. It's like, it's heavy trick room. So it's all, it's got all the fun in it. Giga Noodle. That has got to be the greatest name for a Charizard I've ever seen. By seeing the Venusaur Max. I don't think without the helping hand we'll be able to get the Venusaur with the Airstream. But at the same time, it's not the end of the world. We've still got Talonflame in the back. And it's still got full HP. So we can we can nuke this Venusaur when when we want. Okay, we're gonna see Max Guard. That's It's not better for us because the Torco is gonna come back in. For the Zard. Um, I mean, it has to, right? Uh, we do have a speed boost. Uh, uh, we're still not at speed the Venus, though. Um, and I don't feel like there's very much point. Is that much point of protecting? Oh, could we switch to Urshifu to keep Kingdra? Let's go to Urshifu because we got we got sucker punch there. See Scoundrel, thanks so much for joining the stream tonight and for the follow. Hope you enjoy it with us. Hope you've had a good day. Giga Noodle switching back out to the Tall Call. Okay, so I'm hoping Venusaur attacks into. Urshifu here, so it just takes us down to our Sash. If they read the Talonflame coming in, which they may do, and this will be bad, like we'll lose Talonflame, but it's it's still not the end of this game. Maxus, how's it gonna be? Okay, it's into Urshifu, this is fine. Because I think this next turn they switch the, they definitely switch Torkoal, how do they switch Torkoal out? I think they want to keep weather control, so they switch Torkoal out to Charizard. Um. So we got a couple of options. We could Tailwind, which I don't think we need to do. I think we could we could definitely Brave Bird, and we could Sucker Punch as well. The only issue, I mean, there's no issue doing that at all. Because if we lose Urshifu to Torkoal, then we get Politoed back in, which is fine. And I'm super happy about that. So then we just get Weather Control, um, because it puts them in such a... And this is our last turn of Max, so... A top, a sucker punch, and a brave bird get it, but it's likely that the Venusaur might guard. Oh, it doesn't. Oh, sucker punch should get it. Oh, it's so close. Okay, but it, this ooze is gonna knock it out because it has got the life orb. It's gonna end the talent flame. That's fine. Okay. And then we've got Politoed and Kingdra versus Tokol Charizard. Okay, that's all right. What's everyone think of G-Max Venusaur? I have, like, I literally not played around with it yet. I, it's, like, one of the, like, I definitely want to, like, have a test around with it, 100%. That and Blastoise. Um, but I, I, I'm just too excited about the new, the other new Pokemon that we've got access to now, which are the kind of the new old Pokemon. Um, so I'm a bit more concerned about those, even though they're, 
GMAC Blastoise seems legit pretty good. Right, Giga Noodle. Here we go. I mean, we just need to hit our Muddy Water. That's all we need to do. Um, let's go after the, the Toko. And we hit. This is a good Kingdra. This is a good Kingdra. Okay. Good, good boy Kingdra. Okay, good game to my opponent. Cannonade. Best G Max move name. It is a pretty badass move, isn't it? Like the name for it. Yeah. Vine Lash. <laughs> Lame. I don't know. I like Vine Lash. The animation for Vine Lash is pretty good. I really like that. Okay. Tulsa Bath. Good game. Gym Leader. Let's go there. Okay. We can actually. Can we download Series 5 rules now? Ah. Okay. Cheers, Bebum. That's a good point. So you've got them ready for when Series 5 like kicks off on Wednesday, I guess. So we've got Mr. Bundy up. Adult B uh, playing Alakazam in DD, uh, the Azumarill, P2, Tito, and Excredal. So we've got a sand call there. We've got the Azumarill belly drum, I'm presuming, with the, the Trick Room mod. Um, and then in DD, Alakazam, which is your super fast offensive uh, psychic spam mod. Uh, okay, let's go. Kingdra. And. Hmm. Like, Urshifu's very good here. Urshifu's, like, really good here. Um. I'm gonna go Urshifu. Kingdra. I want Politoed back. I kind of want to bring Talonflame as well, but. I think Amoongus is just a way better option. So let's do that. Lobo VGC, thank you so much for the follow. Thanks for joining us. Hope you've had a good day and I hope you enjoy the stream with us here tonight. What is the Politoed EVs? I will grab that for you after the stream. I will uh, I will let you know. Let me see if I can um let me see if I can pull up my showdown right now. And I'll, I'll grab you a pace of that while we're getting into this match. So we're seeing Alakazam and Azumarill. Not what I expected. I will be honest there. Um, okay. Right. This is the Politoed pace there. That's what I'm using at the minute. Okay, good game. Uh, good luck, man. Have fun. Uh, right. We could hard switch into... Yeah, there's, the, there's always the option to hard switch into Politoed and get an attack off with Kingdra here. Um, okay, so Zam's going out. I'm gonna see Tyranitar come in. Okay. I'm gonna see the Belly Drum set up. I mean, I don't mind the Tar coming in too much right now, because it means we are gonna overwrite the sand. Hugo Crammers, thank you so much for joining us tonight. Thanks so much for the follow as well. Okay, so we get towed in. The only issue here is if we see a drum from this Azumarill, which I would imagine that's what we'll see. Because it, it wasn't, you're not really under any threat. Oh, wow. The zoo's maxing. Wow. Okay, here we go. No belly drum. And yellow Azumarill's definitely the coolest. I love yellow Azumarill. So cool. One of my favorite Pokemon is Umarill. I do love it. Yeah, there's a wicked blow into the Teton. Not going to be exactly what we want to hit it with, but I mean, any damage onto it's useful right now. And Starfall. Is that going to be into? That's going to be into. Yeah, Urshifu. That'll just take us down to our Sash. All right, that's fine. Okay. 
Okay. I think you, like, I would think you switch the T-Tar out right now. The thing is, what we could, we could potentially do is just double this slot and like cover it with a close combat and a scald. Like if anything comes in on that slot, we kind of cover it, cover our bases. Kind of want to wicked blow it though. Just in case the Alakazam comes in there. Maybe the Ndidi. Because um, a Wicked Blow and a Scald should take it down. Like, the T-Tar, I mean. Yeah. I'm going to go for the Wicked Blow. I'm going to cover that slot. Just in case the Alakazam comes back in there. The thing, you, if you've got the extra drill in the back, you want your sand up. Yeah. Okay, it's the Ndidi, which still isn't the worst thing in the world. So it's going to get the Psychic Terrain up, which is fine. I see Zoomerall going to target now. I hope it's into the Politoed. This should take Ndidi down. And if not, I'll be sashed. Oh, is it sashed? Probably not. Oh, it is sashed. Yeah. Boosting that defense down. Okay. Do you bring in the Alakazam now, or do you bring in the Tito? I think you bring in Tito, you know. I kind of want to bring in Kingdra just in case we see the Alakazam. Although, now nah, we're all right. We're all right. We'll bring Amoongus in. Because I think we can... Well, we're relying quite heavily on Amoongus to deal with the, the Azumarill here. Unless it's like Sapsip or Azumarill, and then we are screwed. But I don't think it is. It probably is AV, though. Okay, there's the, the snipe. There's the Alakazam coming in. <laughs> right, okay. Um, uh, okay. We're not in the greatest position at all right now, but. What's his humor all gonna do, really? Psychic Trains, pretty scary, I have to admit. I have to just try and get damage. And how many turns of rain have we got left? That's the thing. Three turns, but like the T-Tar could come in at any point right now. Um, And I just protect, yeah. We'll just protect, okay. I think you double the Politoed here, maybe. And in force. See what this does. Jeez, man, that does so much damage. How much is this gonna do to Zam? Not enough, we need the burn, the chip, and we've got it. It's thoughtful. Okay. That works out better for us. Honestly, they're kind of forced to do that because of the Amoongus on the field so we don't spore everything, but it gets rid of that psychic train, which I, I way prefer. Okay, let's get Kingdra onto the field.
I think what we could potentially do is go... Like, you have to switch to Tito here. You have to switch to Tito. Let's just Rage Powder. Because if you don't switch to Tito, you just lose Alakazam. And yeah, you get a free switch into Tito. But I mean, the zoo's not really doing too much to Amoongus right now. And I don't think it's going to do too much to Among Us. Like, you need Zam. You could switch in Titar. Yeah, you could switch Titar in for Zumarill. And go expanding force with the Zam. And try and get rid of Among Us that way. It'd be an option. Does this take T-Tod on oh, no. I don't know if it will. Hmm. That should do from this range, yeah. So that's fine. And then we can deal with Zam the next turn. Yeah, I think we might be able to do it. Depends, like... <laughs> has the Azumarill got something really weird, like safety goggles now? And it just nails Kingdra and then we just lose. Nah, it's just play around. Yeah, we're super fine. Yeah, and I think we'll probably get Zam through the Protect even. We could be really cheeky and just go for the Max Wormwind into Zam just to get the attack drop onto Azumarill and just Rage Powder again. Okay. And then with our last attacks, we can just go into a zoo with, like, double in with Kingdra and Amoongus. Yeah. Okay. Now we can just go Airstream and we can just go, well, we'll just go Rage Powder game. We don't need to do anything. Yeah, awesome game, man. Still not over, but it feels like it kind of is. I wish I had Sludge Bomb on this Amoongus. It would have made it so much easier. as well. Just Hurricane. And just Rage Powder once again. And now it's a slow execution. Is this AV? Azumarill has got to be. It's got to be. It's so fat. Yeah, it's really like, it takes attacks like a beast. Can't even confuse it either because the terrain's up. Steel Roller, nice. There we go. Okay, we can put this thing to sleep now if we want. But we don't really need to click anything other than Rage Powder at the minute. I like Steamroller. That's the one that gets rid of the terrain, right? 
might be enough it is just about good game my friend that was an awesome set thank you so much for uh for coming on and playing us dude and uh come back anytime that was uh i think everyone's pretty impressed with how well the azumarill dealt with like the onslaught and it was pretty relentless but uh yeah it did awesome yes i would love your league card thank you so much mate I, uh, I really love that. And uh, thanks for coming to the stream tonight. Friends, that is going to be all I've got time for tonight, unfortunately. It's been an amazing stream. Thank you so much to each and every one of you for coming out. You guys want the, the, the rental team. Let's do this. Let's do this. I totally forgot we could do rental teams. But you're not going to be... Well, you can use it on casual battle ladder, of course. So you can use it there or you can use it when the rules start on Wednesday. Might be nice. If you haven't got a team in game yet, it's something to have a play around with. Manage teams you're renting. Manage teams to share. So let's get rid of something that's way old. Uh, let's get rid of this Pika team. I'll also post this on my Twitter later on. So keep an eye out for that. If you've missed the stream and you, you, you want to see it again, I'll post it on my Twitter so you guys can check that out. Uh, check, 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 check. There you go. Sorry, Lou. <laughs> I was hoping Lou wasn't here when I was doing that. I knew it would come back to bite me. Uh, there you go, my friends. I hope you enjoy it. We'll be back on Wednesday, same time, 8 p.m., friends. We'll be playing a brand new archetype. Um, I'm pretty excited about featuring it. It's not something I've really seen doing the rounds yet, so uh, hopefully it'll be a lot of fun. Um, and, uh, yeah, come back, hang out, and test the team out. And if you do play around with it, let me know how you get on with it. It would be great to hear what you think of the team in general. Um, but we'll, we'll leave it there, and um, I'll catch up with you all later.